guys. <clears throat> it is 11.40. My voice sounds really weird. I don't know why. Um, my right shoulder is really killing me today, which sucks because my right arm is what I use the most. So, I don't know why it's hurting. I don't know if I slept on it wrong or what. parks in the one part of the driveway I can't see if there's a car coming from that direction or not so I have to guess <sighs> it's horrible anyway I could technically have the windows down because it's like a little cool outside but it's humid and I'm already not feeling that well so I'll just keep the icing on just a little bit but because it's only 81. It was supposed to be like 86 today. Um, it's like August, I want to say 17th, something like that. And um, anyway, so I'm heading to my fiance's house right now to go eat lunch. Um, and then I gotta do something with my computer to see if it works. If not, I will have to go to the bank. And I really do not want to go to the bank today. I'm I'm just not in the mood to go down there. Uh, basically, if I don't sign up for e-statements, they're going to charge me $5. Well, the thing is, because I opened the savings with these people, uh, and I'm not going to sit there and get charged like $5 for what I've been trying to sign up for e-statements. I've tried everything. So, I did contact one of the ladies that worked out there at the bank, and she told me how to do it, so I'll try it like that. Um, so hopefully it'll work. Because I'm not going to get charged $5 for something I already know how to do. And I don't know why this person is writing my butt, because I'm doing the speed limit. I should just slow down. so I can make 20 bucks even though I'll be putting that back in gas but whatever um Um, we just got done eating lunch not too long ago, and, um, I had spaghetti as he had, uh, beef ravioli, and we were watching Jane the Virgin, we're in, like, episode 8 now, and, um, yeah, I got, like, 10 more episodes left, and that season's done, crazy, but I'm the only one here, um, he went to the car wash to cut grass his mom had to grunt it down for something I don't remember and yeah so I'm just here by myself for right now but she should be back in a minute so yeah um other than that there's really nothing else going on so yeah I just wanted to update you guys so when he gets back we're gonna head out so I'm debating on if I'm gonna go ahead and get gas now or just wait till he gets done. I don't know. But yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Alright old granny, I don't know what you're doing. It's okay guys, it is 2.06. I just got gas. 
I just came to Walmart's gas station because it's closer. So now I'm gonna go back to his house and wait for him to come home. And I guess if he's gonna take a shower, I'll just get a sweet tea from McDonald's, but at the same time, I know I really don't need it. I'm getting hungry again, even though I already ate. Because I also had the snacks, like those chocolate... Hey yeah, guys, I feel like I'm slouching. I need to fix my shelf. I got my pretzels. They're just the Snyder's. The Snyder's of Hanover. I guess. Mini pretzels. I've had these for just a little bag. It's a 3.5 ounce. I had this bag sitting on my nightstand for like a month or so. You know, some throws, but they're still fresh. So it's okay. Um, because I'm hungry. I'm sorry, I have my fiance phone here too. But anyway, um, so the phone cases, which I don't know where my 20 went. Um, to look for that in a second because I don't know where it's at. Um, no. He freaking <clears throat> he put in my little middle compartment over here. It scared me because I got out of the car to go to my house to go pee real quick and came straight here afterwards. I didn't know if it flew out or not because the wind was kind of strong today. I'm sorry if you hear the dryers from the automatic. But anyway, look at this, you guys. I'm gonna try not to expose my address. So, um, I think it's like every month we get Mary Kay books. And, um, look at this. Literally just got this in the middle of the day and it came just like this. Freaking. Crazy. It came like all ripped up and everything. Yes, we got new line. But anyway, I hope I didn't expose anything. Um, hold on, I'm gonna go back and see real quick and I'll come back. Okay, I'm back. All I exposed was the Mary Kay office location, which is fine, whatever. But, anyways, I was talking to my fiance a while ago. Yeah, I've been doing so good, like, I'm on a week in a couple days of uh, no soda it's literally been killing me the past couple days because I've been wanting one so bad for the caffeine and whatnot but I've been doing so bad so I'm drinking water currently five water and um I was talking to him I was like if this goes good after two months of no soda which means I'd be completely I just quit cold turkey. Um, I made the decision for myself. And I plan on sticking with it. And so, after two months, I've decided that <clears throat> this is only if the plan works for no soda. That I'm going to cut out chocolate. Now, but that being said, I know my hairs, like, they're getting long to where it's not long enough to get in a ponytail just yet, but it's almost, so, yeah, you guys gotta ignore that. But, um, soda, chocolate, chips, and fast food are my top four problems 
that I spent a lot of money on. So, with that being said, since I haven't spent much money on soda, you know, where we, because I am quitting, because if you guys sat there and thought, I got at least two 32 ounces a day and maybe a bottle or two. So it's almost four different sodas. Well, it's the same soda, but anyway, four times a day with soda. The 32s are like a dollar something each. And then sodas are, and the bottles are a dollar something each. And then that including if I was at work, got canned sodas, which are 85 cents. So I was spending, I want to say about maybe $10 or more a week on sodas just for myself. That's not including my fiance. Which, he's been doing good. He still drinks soda, but he's not drinking dark soda. Um, so if he's not drinking, like, he's been drinking diet soda in non-dark soda. He's been drinking also the Gatorade 2, which is the lower sugar Gatorade. But, I decided after no soda, I'm going to try to cut out chocolate. And then after chocolate, I don't know if I want to cut out chips first or fast food. Like, I know I'm still going to be eating fast food. And we've been doing good, kind of. Well, not this month, but anyway, we was doing good there for a while. I've been only eating maybe out once or twice a week. But sometimes you just cannot help eating out because you're out and about. You don't have time to really cook. You don't have time to cook some meal at home. So... That's my game plan. Um, I'm excited to see because I know it's it's a lifestyle change and it's crazy. So yeah, don't worry. I will keep you guys up to date on all of that. And um, now, when I say chocolate, I'm not talking about sweets. That okay? Well. Okay, I have top five. We've got sweets, chocolate, soda, fast food, and chips. Okay. Sweets, I consider sweets nothing. How can I put it? That's not chocolate. The other sweets are not like chocolate. Chocolate. Um, like cake, cupcakes, um, ice cream, you know, stuff like that. So, yeah. A lot is to come, and it is August 17th. And, um, so I'm excited. So, with all this going on, like, I'm going to give myself two months each time for each thing. That way, it's not a huge change all at once. It's just going to be, like, a slow progress, I guess. I will be cutting all those, like, cold turkey, except for the fast food. Now, with this being said, if I do get like chips or something, it's not going to be, it'll be like the healthier, like the baked chips or like those protein chips I see at Walmart all the time, like the Quest protein chips. Like I will still probably get those, but not in a huge amount, you know, just only eat a little bit here and there. Because I'm eventually going to try, try again to wing myself to try fruits and vegetables because I know I need to eat them. Some of you probably are watching this and probably like, we don't care, like, just shut up. Then there are some people that probably will care. Like pretzels, I will always eat pretzels, so, um... I might just get like the unsalted or something. I don't know. But yeah, I'm excited. I just wanted to give you guys a whole spiel. Um, I don't think there's really nothing else to talk about. He's still on the first bed he started with since I've been talking with him. Today. So, right now, okay, he has his friend. His friend's name is. Uh, Hi guys, it's 556. I'm just getting ready to find anything. My fiance is here. <clears throat> he has 12 green bread with ham. 
and uh, cheese and mayo. mayo. And I got white bread with cavalini, cheese and mayo.